Hello, folks. My name is Seven Song. I'm a clinical herbalist from Ithaca, New York. Uh, this is a short video uh, describing a free online series of classes that I've been posting on YouTube. Uh, the focus has been on being an herbalist street medic. So a street medic is somebody who goes to protests and helps protesters out however we can, whether it's damage or injury or illness, uh, whatever skills we have to help uh, protesters feel better. Uh, I want to say clearly that this is not a substitute for a longer 20-hour street medic class. If you're somebody who's very interested on being a street medic, please look at re local resources uh, and find a place to do a, a longer class. It's important. There's a lot of logistics involved in being a street medic. And so this is mostly information and skills with a very strong emphasis on herbal skills uh, at these events. So far, uh, we've posted three two-hour classes. If you want to find those classes, you can look at the link below, or you could just type in uh, Seven Song Herbalist. I think, I feel at this point in history with the protests, I think talking about unjust law enforcement against BIPOC people and people protesting and trying to make a change is important. And I think one of the ways that herbalists can be supportive in these environments uh, is to help the protesters at these events uh, in any way that we can. There'll be a number of classes in this series. So there's three now posted. Uh, there'll be a few more. One of them will be discussing the aftercare of protests, which is actually very important. Uh, because if you've been traumatized or injured at the protest, uh, often you take that home with you. And so any way that we could be supportive in those environments. There will be another class uh, this Friday, July 3rd, from 6 to 8 p.m. Uh, Eastern time, if you want to listen to it live, it will also be recorded. Uh, this class will have me discussing more about herbs, and it will also probably have some guest speakers. Um, if you're a person of color and would like to and work at protests and would like to lend your voice here, I'd very much appreciate offering your perspective. Uh, please reach out to contact me um, and let me know how I can be of assistance. What I want to do now is just briefly describe the three classes that we've already had. Um, so if you want to look through them, you have a sense of what you're looking for in which class. So the first class uh, was a lot of logistics about getting arrested about being either a clinical, uh, working at a clinic, or being a roving herbalist. Uh, talk about working in stressful situations, uh, talking about working with other practitioners, working with communications. So a lot of that class is focused on the logistics of being a street medic, which are, again, going to a full 20-hour class is very helpful. That, all that stuff is super important. I just cover it uh, in about an hour or so. Uh, a lot of the reason for this is just to get people excited and wanting to do this and then reaching out and getting more skills. Uh, the second part of that program, that class, this is still the first class, is I discuss a number of the preparations that I use. So including glycerites, tinctures, liniments, oils. And so a focus there on the different preparations, not the specific herbs, but the preparations to bring. Uh, the second class I discuss more about herbs and I cover up to chamomile. Uh, I don't go through herbs very fast. I try to give some in-depth information about each plant. Uh, in that series, in the class two, also Kittis Ache of Chicago, an herbal activist. Uh, in their class, uh, they, in this program, they discussed what it's like to do jail support and other ways and herbal activists can be helpful in their community. And, and Kittis, uh, for Kittis, this would have been, been is in Chicago. And also in that class was Linda Black Elk. Uh, Linda talked about supporting indigenous people and indigenous culture uh, at protests, as well as some of the plants that she used during protests and post protest. The last class uh, was mostly me and talking about different herbs that I use and I covered up to the plant lobelia. So the last class, class three, is, is the one so far most thoroughly just about plants. Um, I think it's helpful if you go through the series, especially the first one covering like the different preparations. So thank you for watching this. Thank you for any work uh, that you do that helps this world make a safer place. 
And thank you, Michelle Marlowe, for continuing helping me uh, put these online. Uh, that's it. Thank you very much.